Hi everyone and welcome to Sunday School. Um, I heard at um, a meeting that in-person Sunday School is going to start really, really soon, like in three weeks on the 12th of September and it got me all excited and, and I got my Daniel and the Lions packet out and was trying to think of what I would be doing if I was getting ready for in-person Sunday school this Sunday. And before I knew it, I was decorating and cutting out stuff. I got the markers out. That's what I'd be doing if I was setting up at the church. I got markers out. I got glue sticks and tape. And I started cutting out um, some decorations for the wall. And I'm going to put them up like this. Isn't that a cute old line there? I put, figured I'd get this guy to go with the other lions and um, decorate, decorate the wall here because I'm not at church to decorate those walls. And, oh, wait a minute. Something's missing off of that lion. Can you tell what's missing? I believe maybe, oops, I cut off the tail. Let me put this tail on. You know, that gives me an idea. If we were having in-person Sunday school, we could play a game called, take the tail onto the lion. Wouldn't that be a great game? Let's get, see if I can get, tail on him like it's supposed to be. There you go, Mr. Lion. Sorry about that. <laughs> That's much better, isn't it? So anyway, I was I was getting excited and, and then I thought I'd be getting markers out and be getting ready for, with songs and, and then I'd, I'd come up with a project for people and this is one for the kids and, and this is one that I have done before where we'd get a lion face and and some yellow um, construction paper and I'd um, glued the lion face on the yellow construction paper and then cut around it like this and then we take our scissors and we'd go snip 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 and make the lion's mane and one year we did it and we cut out his eyes and made a mask for the lion and, or you could just make a lion puppet or you could make a decoration. But anyway, I got so excited. I was thinking about all this stuff that we would do if we were having insert in-person Sunday school this Sunday. And it just got me excited. That's all. All right. Let's get down to having Sunday school. Um, to, well, we're, we're on the third, uh, the third week of doing um, Daniel and the Lions which means we're going to watch part three of the movie Daniel and the Lions, um, which is down here um, for you to, to um, link on. Um, you'll probably have to, you may have to skip some ads. I don't know. But anyway, um, and if you'll remember, um, um, Daniel and his friends, we hadn't talked about lions yet. Daniel and his friends were kidnapped and taken to Babylon and um, Daniel worked so hard that actually the kings liked him and they liked his friends and um, let him be a helper and in the um, kingdom and life was going really pretty good. There were some challenges for Daniel, but it was going pretty good because all the different kings that he lived through liked him. And that's what's happening this time too. But this Sunday, it does involve some lions. So we'll just see what happens. But in the meantime, I like to think about Daniel and how he trusted in God no matter what. He was always happy and honest, worked hard, and always trusted in God. And it made me think of this song. So here we go. A Miss Jana song to start out with. Remember this one? Get your mountain, your sea.
love it. song we were working on um it's just carried over from Jonah but I like it so who did who did who did who did who did swallow jo jo Jonah who did who did who did who did who did swallow jo jo Jonah who did who did who did who did who did swallow jo jo Jonah Swallow Jonah down? I know you do. Whale did, whale did, whale did, whale did, whale did, swallow jo jo Jonah. Whale did, whale did, whale did, whale did, whale did, swallow jo jo Jonah. Whale did, whale did, whale did, whale did, whale did, swallow jo jo Jonah. Whale did, swallow Jonah. Whale did, swallow Jonah. Whale did. For the Daniel part and yes we're gonna learn about what happened with the lions this week are you ready Daniel 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 in the la la lion Daniel 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 in the la la lion Daniel In the, now, in um, our story today, everything was going pretty well for Daniel and, um, and his friends. Um, in fact, it was going so well that King Darius, who liked Daniel a lot because Daniel was very honest and he was very um, dependable and such a hard worker, he made him the, the um, in control of the whole kingdom and um, which was great and Daniel did a really good job with it except for some of the king's servants were not happy and they came up with a scheme that they put together that tricked the king and tricked Daniel into mm, a really bad situation and it involved the lions. And it really upset King Darius because King Darius liked Daniel so much. So, you watch the video and find out what happens and um, we will talk about it again 
next week. And let's, let's get excited about our church by singing our prayer. How about that? May there always be sunshine. May there always be blue skies. May there always be children all around me. May there always be you. May there always be stories. May there always be Now it's time to say goodbye to all my friends. Yes, it's time to say goodbye to all my friends. Oh, it's time to say goodbye, so give a smile and wink your eye. Yes, it's time to say goodbye to all my friends. Goodbye, friends. I can't wait to see you in person on September 12th. We're going to keep our fingers crossed and say big prayers that it really happens. September 12th, in person Sunday school. And we're going to meet, I just want to tell you this real quick, we're going to meet in the new gathering area, which is actually, and that's all children's Sunday school, grades three, I mean ages three through grades five. So it's all of us all together into the new con into the new gathering area, which used to be the old commons area for the preschool. But it's all been redone now. And it's no longer the commons area for the preschool. It's our Sunday school gathering room. So September 12th, gathering room. We'll see you there. And I hope it happens real soon. Bye. I hope you have a good week and see you next time.